welcome back so today we are going to have another comparison video from the title you guys know today we are going to compare those two popular wallet from the Louis Vuitton one is the Zoe wallet one is the Victorian wallet in this video I will share with you the size measurement price and feature of the wallet as well as which one I recommend it and my thoughts of those two wallets so without further ado let's get into it so before we go on further, let's get the measurement out of the way and the Zoe wallet from here to here is 3.72 from here to here is 3 inch and the deep is 1.2 inch. Zoe wallet come from many material. They have the cameras and the cameras that mix with the leather, unpunk leather. They also have exotic leather as well as they have a new collection just launched recently. It's the summer collection and then you can check online each wallet has a different price with a different material in today's video we will talk about the unpunk leather and i will talk about why i choose the unpunk leather instead of the canvas so feature of this wallet is as you can see it's the full leather and with the gold hardware open like this there's two size credit card spot and the two credit card and the two credit card. So in the front, normally I put one credit card and the back pocket, I put two credit card without any problem. The reason is because it's the leather, it's more softer than the canvas. This is also the reason I choose as the leather instead of the canvas because canvas you will feel it's stiff. And here has the gold print, uh, so Louis Vuitton made in Paris. They have the zip uh, pocket, so you can put the coin. Normally, I don't do that, you guys know. And back there, they also have a one pocket. Normally, I just put the insurance card uh, for easy to access. Have, they do have the full size of bill component, so you can put the bill in the here without the folding. This is the Zoe wallet. Now we will talk about the Victorian wallet. Also, I have the leather version and the unpunk leather color red. For that, let's get the measurement as well. From here to here is 47.2 inch. From here to here is 3.74 inch. And the deep is 0.60 inch. Victorian wallet come with the variety material. They have they have the cameras, they have the epi leather, they also have the unpunk leather like this one. Feature of this wallet is also the gold hardware, open like that. I have six credit card spots. So here is a three, here is a three. I have a both pocket there, so you can put more credit card if you want, and definitely fit three credit card here, both sides. They also have the full size bill compartment, so you can put the bill without the folding. The here you have the zipper pull, with the, you can put the coin uh, compartment. Back there doesn't have the pocket. Now we're going to talk about the price that Zoe wore it. The, in the lesser version is 665 and the Victorian wallet is 720 So between them is a $60 difference. So we're going to talk about capacity of both wallets. So I'm going to put everything into the Victorian wallet, then transfer everything to the Zoe wallet, see if Zoe wallet can handle whenever the Victorian wallet can do it. So in here, I have a total eight cards. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I'm gonna put it into the Victorian wallet. So now I have the three credit card here and the three credit card there. And the both side, I put one credit card. You definitely can fit more than one total. I think it, both sides you can fit six at least because this is kind of loomy for the leather the, the best part is very soft than the canvas for total is a credit card and here I have total $15 bill so I'm gonna count one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve 13, 14, 15. Oh, I put it there. 
uh, I normally don't use the coin for the coin press component but uh, because this is the comparison video so I will put uh, some coins into this pocket. Put it, uh, total is uh, 10 coins. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So now we put everything there. So this is a uh, look like after fill everything. So now, so now I'm gonna transfer everything to the Zoe wallet. Oh, I did put it for credit card right now. But then because it's the leather, it can put more. So I'm gonna add those two as well. So each side now I have a three credit card and this side also have a three credit card. So I still yeah, have two more. more. I actually able to get in all eight cards to the 15 bill of the cash. Um, I do have trouble to close. So now I'm going to put the coin as well. So this one, because the coin plus the credit card plus 15 bill, this one definitely have a problem to close. Now I took out five dollar bill from this wallet. So now I can close. So between the Zoe wallet and the Victorian wallet, which one I recommended? They have the similar functionality, but sixty dollars difference. I highly recommend to go for the Victorian wallet because see their capacity. Victorian wallet can fit more than the Zoe wallet. However, the if you have the lifestyle like to carry the mini handbag, then go for the Zoe wallet. So now we're going to talk about why I choose the leather instead of the canvas. For the Victorian wallet, the reason I choose the leather because Victorian wallet and has a button with the leather and this leather is very easy to show the wear and the tear and eventually the whole leather will be peeled. And the people using the nail polish to protect it, which is a good idea of that. And this is the reason I try to avoid it with the but the uh, leather button for the Victor uh, for the Zoe wallet I choose the leather because the leather is much soft especially on the credit spot and it's much softer than the canvas and the other reason also because the canvas they do have a lot of problem with the glazing and however the leather is much better than the canvas now I do have the I do have the one split on the Zoe wallet then I think this is normal wear and tear after one year of the use so that's all about today's video I hope you guys enjoy and I will see you very soon have a wonderful day bye bye